Last week, a normal day at work became a nightmare. A gunman shot two Dallas police officers and this loss prevention officer inside a Home Depot. Scott Painter is still in ICU, but tonight his family says they're hopeful. Rebecca Lopez reports. Officers down, officers down. Those first words over the police radio came from Home Depot security officer Scott Painter. He'd been shot three times. Dallas police officers Crystal Almedia and Rogelio Santander had been shot and critically wounded. Painter reached for one of their radios. After being shot, he was in the store telling people to take cover. His family says he remembers every detail. He relives it pretty frequently. His mother sat down for a one-on-one -on -one interview with News 8 because she wants people to know about her son. Want the public to know what a, a special human he is. She recalls texting and calling him the day of the shooting, but no answer. She watched it unfold on TV. That's when it was reported that there was a third person shot. And at that time, I, I knew that it was probably him. Seeing her son for the first time after the shooting was difficult. Very swollen, mm -hmm. um, but uh, and his head was wrapped because of some of that injury. After multiple surgeries, though, he's beginning the long road to a full recovery. As a mother and as a family, we couldn't be more proud of him. He recently tried to write a note to his mother that said, hold me. This is what he wrote. A couple days ago, was able to, to walk for a bit, and he talked to us for a little bit. His first words after a test was to tell his wife happy anniversary because it was just their six-month anniversary. His family paid their respects to Officer Santander at his funeral, walking with officers who become like family. They say the outpouring of support has made them realize that while there is evil, there is also love and hope. Rebecca Lopez, Channel 8 News. Painter has lived in Dallas for about nine years, most of that working as a loss prevention officer, a job he loves. As for Krista Almeida, the other police officer who was shot, she has been removed to ICU to a regular floor where she'll begin rehab.